Hello everybody, Swaminath here. Today we are going to see MRP, Material Requirement Planning. MRP run, SAP M. So first, what is MRP? It determines what materials are required, how much materials are required, and when it is required. This is MRP. Next, the process I'm going to do is create two materials in MM01, execute MRP, and once when you execute, execute the MRP on the back of it, Purchase requisition will be created. Purchase requisition will be created. Once the purchase requisition is created, I'm going to convert it to purchase order and I'm going to do goods receipt and vendor errors. The purchase requisition where we can be found, M, where, where can we find this MD0 transaction. Transaction for MD0. Now let's go to system and let's let me create a material MM0. Material MM01. Let me create material. Industry mechanical engineering and raw material. Raw material. I'm going to create raw material. Press enter. My plant is MA03, storage location MA03. Press enter. And I'm going to create sugar. Now, KG. Enter metal group. Enter volume. Press enter. Enter. Now, MRP type is V1. V1. What is V1? Let me tell you what is V1. Manual reorder of coin with external purchase requisition. V1. Manual reorder point with external purchase requisition. My reorder point is 20 kgs. And my MRP type is MA01. MRP controller is MA01. Press enter. Lots. Lot size is HP. HP. Press enter. Maximum stock level is 30. So once when I create, once when I execute the MRP, 30 kgs will be created. Once that when, once when the quantity going less than 20, again when the MRP is executed, another 20, 30 more kgs will be ordered in the purchase requisition. That is what the meaning is. Press enter. 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 Select valuation class 3000. 3000 is my valuation class. Press enter. Enter. And save it. Let me save this. Save. This is my material. Material. Let me take this material. This is my material. Another one more material I'm going to create. Enter this material. Press enter. So I do, I'm going to copy MA0. MA0. MA03. It's my plan. Storage location. MA03. It's my storage location. Press enter. This time it's going to be milk powder. Milk powder. It is 10 kgs and 20 kgs. I'm going to change it 20 kgs. 20 kgs. So the once when I execute MRP, 20 kgs will be created. Purchase requisition with the quantity 20 kgs will be created. Once that 20 kgs comes below below 10 kg, again order or uh, purchase requisition will be created for another 10 20 more kgs. The order is coming below 10. That is, the threshold quantity is coming below 10. Another 20 more kgs will be ordered. That is the name. Press enter. Let me save this. Now, let me take this material out. Now, let's go to, I'm going to execute MRP in MD01. MD01, I'm going to execute MRP. Let's go to slash and MD01. Transaction code MD01. My plant is MA03. It's my plan. Across plant, I'm going to execute MRP. For all the material, it executes MRP for all the material. Purchase requisition. I'm going to select purchase requisition. Create purchase requisition. One. One. Now, press enter. 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 
MRP is getting run. Two purchase requisition will be created for this. See here, two purchase requisition. Now, go to MD04. MD04, transaction code MD04. Press enter. See here, for purchase requisition, this is my PR. This is my PR. PR number one. Another one, six. Six. Better than six. Here, this is PR, second PR. Now, I am going to create purchase order based on this PR. Now, let's go to purchase requisition based on this purchase. Slash ME21 can. ME21 can. Document overview on. Click on to purchase requisition. Purchase requisition. Scroll down MA03. It's my plan. MA03. Let me delete this material. MA03. Execute. See here. One, two. Two purchase requisition has been cre created and it has been. I'm going to adapt all both the both the purchase requisition. Select adapt. Select, adapt. Now, my purchase organization is MA0, purchasing group. Let me enter the supplier, T0728. my supplier, press enter. Now, to the right, see, not this one, not this one. Select, let me remove this. Not this one. Want to remove this deleted? Yes. Twenty two. Select adapt. Twenty two. Twenty four. Now let me enter double double zero. One two double zero. Press enter. Let me save this. Yes. Double link onto this line item. Let me take this purchase order. I'm going to do goods plus the invoice. Go to slash it MIG. Go to goods plus. Let me do goods plus. Enter. Click onto this non order item. Let me enter storage location. MA03 is my storage location. MA03 is my storage location. Select both item OK and post. Post. Now go to slash and MIRO. I'm going to invoice verification. Calculate tax. Enter purchase order number here. Before that, let me change the company code. Go to edit switch company code. GB10. GB10. GB10 continue. Enter 857. Today's Calculate tax. Enter purchase order number here. 6767260. This amount. This amount. Press enter. Enter baseline date. This amount. And save it. This is the process of MRP. Thank you.